Hey everyone! As a general rule, innovation is measured by how many iterations there are and how much progress is made between each one. If you can shorten the time between iterations, the rate of improvement is much higher. For example, if it takes a couple of days to trade a model, it only takes a couple of hours. That's a big deal, but the pass a test here, and I've told the Dojo team that it works if the software team wants to turn off the GPU cluster, but fails when they want to leave the GP GPU cluster on. Tesla's investors are excited about the company's newest patent. It shows big steps forward in how Tesla works with robots, focusing on the complex neural networks and machine learning methods that let these bots do their jobs with unprecedented accuracy, efficiency. We're not just talking about small changes. Tesla is pushing the limits of what bots can do from smart power control to moving around on their own. There's a move away from standard solutions like mobile phones in this patent. This shows that Tesla is committed to making high-performance technologies that are tailored to their specific needs. Whether you're a devoted Tesla fan or a beginner interested in the newest AI and robotics, this show has something for everyone. You'll learn a lot about Tesla's technology plan and where it's going next in this episode, so buckle up as we go into the details of this groundbreaking patent right here on Tesla Stock News. Don't forget to like this video. If you like what we write and want to stay up to date on everything Tesla, let's get started. This patent introduces a sophisticated use of neural networks and machine learning at the core of the bot's functionalities, allowing precise navigation and object identification. These technologies are now key to letting the bots move like humans, thanks to the innovative design of actuators that include motors, gearboxes, positioners, and controllers optimized through neural networks. As we dig deeper, the patent shows how the actuators are carefully aligned to facilitate humanoid kinematics, which lets the bots move in ways that are very similar to human actions. The patent also talks about how Tesla carefully manages its intellectual property by filing these patents before they become public. Tesla defends its innovative technologies, making sure that their groundbreaking work is safe from possible intellectual property disputes. Now we'll talk about how Tesla's bots are designed. The patent goes into more detail about how machine learning models can be combined with picture sensors. This setup not only powers the bots, but also manages a complex vision-based system that tells the actuators what to do. This lets the bots interact with their surroundings in a way that is similar to how humans do it, in a dynamic, flexible way. Tesla's method shows how dedicated they are to making machines that are not only useful, but also smart and able to interact with humans. The patent has a lot of information about how to use convolutional neural networks and transformer networks. These technologies are very important for turning video data from cameras on Tesla cars and robots into actionable vectors. This process has several steps, and the machine learning model uses different parts to turn raw input into outputs that the system can use. This more complex method lets Tesla systems respond more accurately and quickly. Advanced camera setups and neural network technology from Tesla. The details of the patent include different camera setups, such as side, back, and mother's eye cameras that are built into Tesla cars. These cameras set important visual data to neural networks, which process and use it for self-driving and bot movement. This integration shows how Tesla is using cutting-edge technology to make its cars and robots safer and more useful. This is different from traditional industrial robots, which use vision systems and inverse kinematics to make accurate movements. Tesla's method uses a system that is more intuitive. This system uses machine learning to make movements possible without clear calculations, making it more like a human being in terms of responsiveness and adaptability. With the help of advanced AI technologies, this way is a big change from traditional robotics to more natural and fluid robotic interactions. The patent also gives us a glimpse into an exciting future where bots are not only flexible but also great at sports that humans usually do, like tennis and skiing. This is made possible by advanced training programs that use neural networks and machine learning to make the bots better at these skills. Tesla also hints at the possibility for a skills-based system. Marketplace is an online store where users can buy specific skills that weren't already programmed into bots. This makes them more flexible and adaptable. Now let's talk about the bigger tech trend of companies using language models that are specifically designed to meet. 
In another part of the patent, Tesla shows big plans for a wide range of bot forms. The company wants to use millions of different types of Tesla bots, which will look like everything from animals to people. This huge range makes it hard to adapt machine learning algorithms to fit the specifics of each embodiment. Since these bots can't be made exactly the same, each type needs its own set of algorithms that can make the most of its functions and interactions, making sure that all models work efficiently and effectively in their intended roles. Finally, the copyright information Tesla strategically built its full self-driving computer with information it got from its relationship with OpenAI. This partnership was key in teaching Tesla's FSD computers advanced neural networks, which made them better at making decisions. The patent also suggests that a local voice interface could be added to allow real-time communication between drivers and the FSD system. This feature is meant to make the vehicle more responsive to driver inputs and preferences, making the driving experience more intuitive and tailored to each person's needs. Tesla is still pushing the limits with its latest patent, which aims to change the way cars talk to their passengers. The patent describes an innovative way to do this by saying that cars should be guided by multiple heads with expertise in different areas. The goal of this method is to use specialized information from various fields to improve and guide how the vehicle acts in different situations. As a result, driving is not only smoother, but also easier to understand. This makes sure that passengers can connect with the car without any problems and fully understand what's going on. Pay attention another interesting thing about Tesla's innovations is that he might work with explainable AI to improve control over robot intelligence. This partnership shows a strategic move to integrate Say, which could play a key role in governing how bots think and act. The concern is not just about functional control, like having 25% of the vote on decisions, but also about how deeply AI understands and interacts with the world. Tesla's approach remains focused on improving movement and neural network applications for this purpose rather than broadening AI's world understanding. There is also a focus on improving user interfaces and language interactions, which are necessary for making communication between humans and robots more natural and effective. Because of specific needs and worries about responsiveness, Tesla's innovative path has led to a strategic shift away from mobile A. Tesla saw that Mobis solutions were generally made to fit a wide range of driving needs that could be used with different cars. However, Tesla's specific needs for performance and responsiveness meant that a different approach was needed. Mobile E could potentially use Tesla's large computing power, which would be good for both parties. Tesla made the choice to pivot toward solutions that are more in line with their unique performance and technological goals. More research into Tesla's innovations and new patent gives us a look into how the bot brain moves naturally. The patent, which includes pictures from the AI Day 2 presentation, shows different actuators and graphs that show how they work. The patent text isn't very detailed, but it gives a very good overview of how the right actuators and motors were chosen for Tesla's bots. In another area of Tesla's technological exploration, this process is very important for making sure that the robots work well and answer naturally to different situations. Now the attention is on making the best use of power for all tasks. What the paper says through this analysis, Tesla looked at how much power is needed for a wide range of jobs, from moving heavy loads to lifting lighter ones. Tesla wants to use fewer motors that are bigger. This method not only makes the mechanical design easier, but it also makes things more efficient by using less power for different jobs. As we wrap up today's session, this strategy optimization shows how Tesla is always working to improve energy use and efficiency so that their machines are both powerful and cost-effective. Look in depth at Tesla's newest technical advances. We've seen Tesla's decision to stop using mobile email shows that they are dedicated to meeting specific performance and responsiveness requirements. Additionally, their most recent patents show big improvements in the intuitive design of bot brains and optimizing power usage for a variety of tasks. These patents show that Tesla is always working to improve and perfect their technology. With these new developments, some questions arise. How will Tesla's decision to stop using standard solutions like mobile email affect the capabilities of their future vehicles? What effect will the new actuator and motor designs have on how well and how well 